We're just days away from the start of Washington State baseball season. First pitch for the Cougs out in Arizona on Friday facing Villanova. WSU was picked to finish in ninth place in the Pac-12. but That's no skin off their back. I wish we were projected last. I mean, just to put a little more of a chip on our kids' shoulder. It may be more than a chip. Let's say a boulder on WSU baseball's shoulder heading into the 2023 season. I think uh, we'll shock the, the conference for sure. It will be one of those tough, gritty teams that when teams walk away, they're going to be like, dang, those guys, they, they get after it. Fourth year head coach Brian Green's team enters this season with a blue collar mentality. The Cougs have had a winning season every year in Green's tenure, but now they're looking to get over the hump. We've had three winning seasons. It's great. We're moving this way. The program's better. Uh, but we're trying to cross the line as a program. We're trying to get to the postseason. The thought around the program is this is the best team in Pullman since Green has taken over. A big reason for that belief is the depth and experience of the pitching staff. The Cougs return starters Grant Taylor and McCabe Cottrell, along with multiple key bullpen pieces such as Caden Calber, Cam Liss, and Chase Grillo. You have a good amount of trust with those guys, so having those arms back is giving us a great opportunity into the season. Um, and then we got some new pieces that are coming in that I'm excited to see what they're capable to do against some of these Pac-12 opponents. Yeah, we're excited about that piece. I mean, we feel like we've got six or seven guys who could start on a Sunday or a Tuesday. Uh, that's new for our program. Offensively, four starters return, the key piece being all Pac-12 DH Jacob McKeon. Similar to pitching, they feel the depth is there to build around their slugger. Yeah, number one, you bring back McKeon. Uh, just to have that comfort, uh, you bring back Bryce Matthews, who looks really good right now. We just like our, our, our depth, and we just haven't had that. McKeon feels the same way, taking pressure off him to be the guy. For me, it's honestly just kind of keep doing my thing. Um, and I feel like I can trust the process, trust the preparation that I've been doing. I know i got teammates behind me that are going to support me no matter what. And I think that's just really a, a nice feeling to have. Will the Cougs be the Pac-12 surprise team this year? Only time will tell. I think there's going to be some explosive stuff happening on the field. Again, the Cougs open the season on Friday against Villanova at 11 a.m. out in Peoria. Their first home game will be against Southern Indiana on March 3rd.